Today, our leaders are in Hoth Harbour. But they won't have time to take in the sea air, as they're facing their final Dublin Fire Brigade challenge. And today, they're also facing competition from the experts. This time, it's personal, and we're taking it pretty seriously. I broke a nail. <laughs> I, we have to beat them today. I don't, I don't like losing. The experts are there every single week to help the leaders, except today. This is war. Bring it on. You want the A-game, John? If I kept you ladies. But serious business. Your report card is going to say it needs to try harder. Does it, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Hoth Harbour. This is your final challenge. It's a straightforward head-to-head -head race. First, the teams will enter the water from the 20-foot pier wall, form a crocodile tail, and together, swim 50 metres out to a floating platform. One by one, the teams must then haul themselves back to the pier on a guide rope, climb the ladder, and ring the bell. Only when the bell is rung can the next team member start. The first team to get all its members back and ring the bell wins the challenge. With Aoife pregnant and Dr. Kira on a sick note, the teams are uneven. Experts, you're a man down today. I've never been happier to be sick in my whole life. It's fantastic. That wouldn't be fair to leave you at a disadvantage. We're going to balance the teams. You's get Neil to help you out today. Woohoo! Lads, this is Neil. <laughs> <laughs> the leaders carried their teammates. It's only fair you should do the same. All's fair in love and war, as they say. Right, pick up your teammate, let's go! With Kira, Aoife and Dan cheering on from the sidelines, it's time to take the plunge. <laughs> and luckily for some, there's no points for technique. She's very cold. Both teams are in the water and in crocodile formation, including the less than buoyant Neil. Go! <laughs> When we started the crocodile, they took off so quickly. I was surprised. Together! We just went hell for leather. We just went splash, splash, splash. You're doing great! How are the leaders so much faster than the experts? Because they're not dragging a body. Experts, you're way behind, experts! They were eating our dust. Come on, leaders, that's brilliant work. You're nearly there! <laughs> when we got to the platform, the leaders were already there. Lucy jumped in our side. Our rope. I was directed over to the other side of the platform. That's why I went on my rope. While Lucy heads for home, we're still floundering at the platform. But once up, I'm eager to make up some ground. Catherine bombed across the rope. Come on, Lucy! I forget who I'm cheering for! I won't! Lucy climbs the ladder, but I'm hot. Well, freezing actually on her heels. Come on, she's right behind you. Lucy, ring the bell! OK, next leader, off we go! With the second leader already on the way, I finally reached the bell. Come on! Catherine rang the bell and it was my turn to get into the water. Carl is in the drink, but as the fitness expert in the team, he's volunteered to carry his new best friend all the way home. Pulling the along was tough. For a change, it was good to see Carl um, working out as hard as he could. And Neil's wingman is making good time, while Claire rings the bell... ..and Nolene heads for home. Nolene, you're like a dolphin in the water. You're flying. That's brilliant. Carl scales the ladder, but there's no sign of Neil. Ring the bell, babes. <laughs> With the final expert in the water... That's it, Eddie! Well John is left marooned on the platform. Nolene is struggling at the ladder, and Eddie catches her to put us ahead. I saw Eddie coming up the ladder. He was ahead of the leaders. I thought that they had it. It looks as though the leaders' challenge is scuppered. We're actually going to win! I got there and I rang the bell. I said, that's it, we won. But all is not as it seems. Remember Neil? Experts, I think you're missing somebody! I realised we had to get Neil up the ladder. Can't leave a man behind, can you? With the final leader, John, heading to shore, forgetful Carl has no choice but to take one for the team. Oh, Carl, 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 Carl! to the ladder. But with a final push, John is already there. Come on, come on, John, come on, come on! You have to 
to win. Like, this taking part business doesn't count at all. The experts desperately haul Neil up the wall. It's neck and neck between the fittest and the unfittest competitors. Come on, car! <laughs> the leaders have done it, and we finish a credible second place. As always, gracious in defeat. Fair play, that was the toughest challenge we've ever, ever, ever done. No question about it. But in the end, the better team won. Yeah. Yeah.